This is CPM Precalculus Chapter 1, Number 60. So this question is asking us, why is this called the point-slope form? Okay, and this is referring to the math notes above that talks about the point-slope form of a line is when you're given a slope of m, right, slope m, and a point, so slope m and a point point x1 comma y1 and you're told a line has the slope m and it passes through this point and then it has the form y minus y1 equals to m times x minus x1 or if you add y1 to both sides you have the form y equals m x minus x1 plus y1. Okay, so these are both called the point-slope form of a line. So why is that called the point-slope form? Well, easy. Point, slope, point, slope. It's called this because to write the equation of a line in point slope form you need a point and a slope okay a point one point so let's even erase that a point oops erase a point and a slope you need exactly one point right and the only slope, and the slope, because it's only one slope for each line. Okay, so how does it compare to our slope-intercept form? Our slope-intercept form is y equals mx plus b, and this equation of the line has the slope as well, right? So we have a slope here, and it has the intercept. Well, which intercept? The y-intercept. So how does it compare? Well, both need the slope, right? Both need m, but this one needs the y-intercept, the y-intercept. Okay, well, what is the y-intercept? Well, remember the y-intercept, here's our x-axis and our y-axis. The y-intercept is simply where the line, wherever it is, intersects our y-axis. So that y-intercept is actually a point with x value, it doesn't go to the left or right, 0, and y value, whether it's going to be up or down or nowhere, b. So this is actually a point as well, but it's a special point where our x value is 0 and our y value is the y-intercept. Okay, so both forms the point slope form and the slope intercept form require us knowing the slope, right? Slope and a point. Um, the point slope form can be any point on the line. The slope intercept form requires the y intercept point. Okay, so this is a point. Okay, so this ends CPM pre calculus chapter 1, number 60.